For those of you who don't know, people have been bullying Ariana Grande for losing a lot of weight. Well, have gotten worse, you guys, because not only are now people concerned for Ariana and her health, but they're also accusing her of having an ED and comparing her weight loss to Eugenia Cooney. When is this gonna end? As sensitive as a topic this is, unfortunately, you guys, some people still believe that Ariana Grande's health needs to be discussed since she's been trending on social media for days. And all I can say is that it was not for the right reasons. So without further ado, you guys, let's just jump right in and go to the beginning where it all started. Ever since Ariana Grande began acting for Nickelodeon, you guys, she's been getting bullied and harassed by a lot of people on the internet, including members of her own Nickelodeon crew. Yeah. I'm not sure if you guys still remember, but a couple of years ago, tons of rumors and accusations started resurfacing out of nowhere about Ariana and how she was allegedly a victim of Dan Schneider. Now, I know you're asking yourself, who the hell is Dan Schneider? Well, Dan Schneider is a former Nickelodeon producer who worked on several of the network's popular shows, including Victorious, which Ariana starred in. And while some fans and media outlets believe that there may have been inappropriate behavior or an inappropriate relationship between Ariana and Dan, this rumor came after after Dan received criticism in the past for his management style and his treatment of young actors, and how he allegedly made a lot of former child actors who had worked with him feel uncomfortable or mistreated on set. Of course, people started connecting this accusation about Dan to Ariana Grande, and how she might have been bullied by Dan on set as well after many crew members came to reveal some information. And that's when things went downhill, you guys, since not only did Dan get exposed for sexualizing many cast members in the show, but he also got exposed for forcing Ariana to do inappropriate stuff on camera. Check this out, you guys. That could never happen because your uvula is that swingy thing in the back of your throat right here. So there's no way you could get it stuck between a hamster's toes. After tons of videos and accusations about Dan started resurfacing on the internet, many people started becoming concerned about Ariana's mental health and how she might have been traumatized by Dan throughout all these years. However, Ariana herself has not publicly spoken about any negative experiences with Dan Schneider. In fact, she has been generally supportive of Schneider in interviews by thanking him for giving her a start in the entertainment industry and praising him for his creative vision. So it's unclear whether there was any inappropriate behavior or relationships between the two, but a lot of people still believe that Ariana faced a lot of issues with Dan in the past and she's only hiding the truth because he gave her a push in her career. Anyways, after Ariana moved from her acting career and began releasing songs, she received a lot of praise and love for her work and talent following her debut album, Yours Truly. And to be honest, this might have been one of the biggest moments in Ariana's career because the amount of support she received from fans felt like a dream to her. However, all of this took a wild turn once Ariana decided to release her sophomore album, My Everything, which opened up a lot about her personal struggles. And from the beginning, you guys, people noticed that Ariana Grande had lost a lot of weight during this era. Yeah, guys, not only did she get body shamed for looking way too skinny in the cover art of her album, My Everything, but she also got bullied throughout this entire era for not taking care of her health and eating well. This situation opened a lot of conversations on social media about Ariana Grande's body to the point where some people decided to make a challenge whether they could recreate Ariana Ariana Grande's pose for her album, My Everything, on a small chair. And of course, you can imagine the hate Ariana received for it since many people failed to do the challenge as they described Ariana to be way too skinny and petite for her to sit on a small chair. Anyways, after years of people constantly bullying Ariana Grande for her weight loss, unfortunately, this woman got involved in another internet discussion following her Sweetener album release. Only this time, you guys, people noticed that Ariana gained a little bit of weight following her breakup with Mac Miller and the tragic incident that happened in Manchester. I wouldn't say that a lot of people weren't happy about Ariana gaining some weight since she was concerning a lot of fans throughout the years for being way too skinny. But during this era, you guys, a lot of fans felt that Ariana was the healthiest she's ever been. Until Ariana made the decision to take a break from releasing music years later to focus on launching her makeup brand, Rem Beauty. I'm not sure whether this was the right decision for Ariana or not because if we're talking success-wise, Ariana's beauty brand was killing it on the market as it became one of the top top highest selling makeup brands worldwide. However, this decision you guys made Ariana distance herself from her fans as not only she deactivated her Twitter account following the hate, but she also made her entire Instagram account based on her makeup brand and not her as an artist. This situation affected many fans who supported Ariana and as a result, a lot of people took to social media to bully Ariana and accuse her of Asian fishing after pictures of her wearing her makeup products on her face went viral. For some reason, a lot of people didn't understand 
understand that Ariana had to wear a lot of makeup on her face to promote her beauty brand, as many of her fans were not used to seeing her be this glammed. But unfortunately, this was only the beginning of the end, because a couple of months after Ariana got accused of Asian fishing, she then got bullied for losing tons of weight for her role in the upcoming movie, Wicked. I don't want to be dramatic, but this was probably the worst time I've ever seen Ariana getting bullied for her weight, because not only were people accusing Ariana of having an ED, but they were also comparing her looks to Eugenia Cooney, who also struggles with an ED. Check this out. Ariana is turning into Eugenia Cooney. If we can openly worry about Eugenia, girl, I think it's time we start worrying about Ariana. Why does Ariana look like Eugenia Cooney now? During this time, Ariana was constantly deleting pictures and turning off her comment section whenever people decided to come after her looks and her weight. Although this week, you guys, no one could have stopped people from bullying Ariana regarding her weight after a couple of pictures of her posing with cast members of her upcoming movie went viral on Twitter. And of course, not only did Ariana start trending for looking way too old in her new pictures, but she also made headlines after tons of people accused her of being anorexic. Here's what people had to say. Ariana Grande is anorexic and people saying that she's always been skinny have no clue. She's aging miserably. I've lived with anorexia for eight years now and I know it when I see it. No one looks naturally that skinny. She looks unhealthy. It's crazy that despite all these years of Ariana facing criticism and bullying, she has continued to be an advocate for body positivity and self-love. And she has inspired many people around the world to embrace their unique qualities and to feel comfortable and confident in their own skin. Don't forget to leave your comments on this situation down below and make sure to click on the tab above for more videos on these celebs.